I, I predicted this. I predicted this. If you, if you if you go back and you watch when I when I when I premiered mm. the Diddy thing at the end of the video, I predicted this, and it's and, it, and it's, it's 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 hard it's hard to accept, but you've got to be real sometimes, cause you know what I'm saying. Like I never really ever really want to turn my back on my friends like that. I don't want my I don't want my fans to be ashamed to say they like me. You know what I'm saying? When one of my fans say, yeah, I like Skepta, I don't want someone else, one of these brothers to say, oh, you're moist, you can't listen to my man, you get me? So that's what I've always had in my body. And it's not because, it's not solely because of them, it's because of myself. Because if I'm somewhere and I feel like I'm not happy with my music, there's no point in me doing this. Like I said, I produce and I MC and I've, and I've got, you know, this life. I ain't gonna waste it doing, doing music that I, that, I, that I won't listen to. I listen to all my tunes. All ask, ask any one of my friends, I listen to all my tunes. And it might sound mad, like I listen to their own tunes, but I always listen to my tunes. Because I love my music, do you know what I mean? And if, if I love my music, you will get the energy from me. You'll, you'll be able to feel it, you'll be able to hear it in the bars. Like, yeah, my man likes it. So that's what I've always tried to do and keep in my, in my music. And that's why none of that sh affects me. If I, hear, so if I hear an MC don't chart tomorrow, I don't care. You know what I'm saying? But if one of them lot here, that guy's not charting, they start worrying, like, oh my god, my man didn't chart, you know? Shh, like, what are we gonna do? I don't care about that, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'll, like, I'll go and make an underground tune tomorrow and it'll still be big, my name's hot. I'll just carry on going, carry on going, and hopefully my fans stick by me. You know what I'm saying? And I shouldn't, I shouldn't be, my music career shouldn't be going, shouldn't be descending. It should never, it should be like that because you're supposed to build. You can't be one day, how can I be the biggest artist in the UK in one minute? And what, so what did I do? I don't do nothing wrong. You know what I'm saying? So I learn from other people's mistakes. They can learn from theirs, learn from other people's and just try. It's a fight, man. This UK game is not, it's not cut out for what we want to do. Because it's not big enough. You know what I'm saying? And it's a new, it's new music. Like I said, I just come back from um, New York. I was in Bloomingdale, I was in Macy's. They was playing Rick Ross, like, Nine piece, like hard Rick Ross tunes in Bloomingdale's. You know what I'm saying? But you gotta understand that their generation of music is is, is gone far now. Do you know what I'm saying? I want to see that we're still new with it. So it's hard working with with what you got. But you know, hopefully I'll be remembered and I leave a good legacy rather than have a two year career. <laughs>